Initializing. Welcome to Infinite Guides, I am Zacubus and this is the guidebook into Infinite Crisis and today's lesson is on the stolen power x-ray vision. This is really really a great stolen power for support champions especially. It helps you scout out your enemy, find out enemy cameras and just give you a general better map control if you use it well enough. Just like all the other stolen powers in Infinite Crisis there is the standard version and then there's enhanced versions of them which you can unlock later on. and the standard x-ray vision gives you increased vision for 8 seconds uh, around the map and you can detect uh, stealth or stealth champions in that area and it has a cooldown of 120 seconds. Now this is one of the advanced versions, Gaslight Catwoman's x-ray vision and this gives a much larger vision range for those 8 seconds so when you have it turned on you can see more of the map. This is useful because then you can scout out whole entire areas to find out cameras or if your enemy is nearby. Uh, the cooldown is the same time. And finally we have Atomic Poison Ivy's X-ray vision. Now the main difference between this and the other two is that it has a reduced cooldown. So it, its cooldown is only 100 seconds rather than 120 so you're more often to use it but the range of it is the same as the standard X-ray vision so you won't see as far but it's still very good for that cooldown. Now if you're picking up X-ray vision you're usually a support champion and Really, you've got to keep on top of actually eliminating the enemy's cameras as often as possible. And as you can see here, I just find that camera in the meteorite shower there. It's a great place to hide them. Even when you've got your x-ray vision on, they're very hard to spot in there, uh, as I said in my last guide. Um, but now you want to eliminate as many cameras as you can throughout the game. Eliminating that information from your enemy team is vital for your team's success. It will give you much more opportunities to gank lanes. It will force your enemy champions to actually play more defensive in their lanes because they won't know if a gank's coming or not and they have to play more defensive this gives you more free farming in the lane or you know if they happen to be playing aggressive they won't see a gank coming in on them which is exactly what you want now another tip when actually trying to eliminate any cameras is not to rely just on your main screen like what just happened there because if I looked at my mini map, I would have noticed there was another camera that I could have taken out. And I just, I didn't look at my mini map at the time, so I left that camera up. And, you know, little mistakes like that can cost you quite heavily later on in the game. So just remember to always check your mini map when you're using your x ray vision, as you can often scout things that you wouldn't normally see on your main screen. There's a couple more examples of the x ray vision in action. If you feel as if you're going to get ganged, or, you know, you have like that sixth sense tingling feeling then pop your x-ray vision and as you can see you can see the guys hiding in the stealth pad and luckily my team is well placed for a, a convenient gank to uh, close them down so it's always good to get that extra vision if you just feel you're unsafe at a particular time you know you're overextended on a lane perhaps or it's just gone a little bit too quiet on the minimap and you can't see any enemies about now another good place to use your x-ray vision is when you want to go for those team objectives like the Raider or Leviathan and you really want to use your x-ray vision to find out if there are any cameras in the local area and here it looks clear until Mecha Superman just decides to uh, do exactly the same. He's scouting out with his uh, x-ray vision and also putting some cameras down so they're, they're on to us here but it's always good to make sure that you clear out any cameras before doing any team objectives, eliminate that information from your team and they're less likely to come and stop you or won't know what you're doing or attempting. Now one of the best things about x-ray vision is that it eliminates stealth champions immediately so if they're going to be aggressive onto you or you want to actually finish off an enemy champion that's stealth like Nightmare Batman here, x-ray vision gives you that chance to continue your damage as much as possible without them trying to juke you or get out and uh, a lot of stealth champions often rely too heavily on their stealth to get away and often push up lanes where they shouldn't be and you can really take advantage of that and continuously gank them with x-ray vision. Thanks for tuning in guys, I hope this lesson has been useful to any new players out there to Infinite Crisis. Remember to like, comment, subscribe and check out next week's lesson coming soon.